determining which good sentiment to wish at each holiday. Is there any rhyme or reason to how we wish people sentiments for various holidays? For example, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, Happy Birthday are all acceptable sentiments but if we were to interchange them. Happy Christmas, Merry New Year, Merry Birthday. People would agree that, though the sentiment is preserved, the delivery seems a bit off, at least in American English. I asked because I went to wish a friend a happy Yom Kippur today but thought I should check first on what the standard well-wishing is, luckily I checked first. As it is not a festive day at all, but rather a somber occasion to reflect and pray. Do we just use happy unless it is Christmas? Are there any other classy variants that can be substituted seamlessly, for example something like Jolly New Year or Stella Retirement? Happy Christmas is fine in British English, but it does sound odd in American English. As Peter Shaw says, for most other holidays, happy is fine. There's no rule, they're all idiomatic. Even though merry, happy, jolly, and synonyms are, well, synonymous, it doesn't make them interchangeable. People just use patterns over and over again to the point where the minutest change sounds strange, this should be part of the definition of idiom. Sometimes such patterns arise organically, out of the common ether, and other times one person says something clever, in person or in media, and people start copying it. As to alternatives for Christmas and other festive holidays, one could use good, great, or wonderful. They are both innocuous and non-idiomatic enough to not sound too strange. Have a good Christmas have a great, Thanksgiving have a wonderful Easter holiday. As to holidays in general, correct, not every holiday warrants either a happy greeting or even a special greeting at all, and only culture will tell you what is appropriate. Many religious and political holidays, Good Friday slash Tisha B'Av slash Ashura or Memorial Day, you just show up and commiserate. Of course, by cultural analogy with the juggernaut of Christmas, many special days seem to warrant a special similar greeting, like Happy Halloween where historically there never was one. There's no necessity here at all, it's just what people like to do and like to copy in others. I used to think that Happy Christmas was merely the result of people saying the politically correct Happy Holidays and then switching back to Christmas but not replacing the happy part with Mary. However, there's a John Lennon song with the title Happy Christmas, War Is Over, which was released well before the PC trend. Incidentally, the Japanese have imported Merry Christmas into their language, but don't use the word Merry in any other context. If you want to subscribe to the channel, please consider subscribing.